And finally, from us today, real life Iron Man. Hollywood science fiction is coming to life in Utah, where military scientists are working to develop exoskeletons for the U.S. Army that will one day, hopefully, provide U.S. soldiers with superhuman strength. The BBC's Rajas Merchandani filed this report from Salt Lake City. At a research facility in Utah, they're turning sci-fi into reality. A bit like the film Iron Man, scientists here are building a robotic suit for soldiers. It doesn't require any effort, you know, for me to move around. And it weighs more than 100 pounds. Can you feel it's it? It's like 190 pounds. No, you don't, you don't feel the weight of the mission at all. The robotic suit follows the test engineer's movements. With it, he can easily pull down more than 90 kilos, more than his own weight. Just look what it's like without it. The aluminium exoskeleton provides enormous strength and endurance. Back in Greek mythology, people talked about uh, superheroes. People are obsessed with this kind of idea of adding capability. And so I think their interest is driven by every other human. The idea that if you could fly or you could pick up large wakes or you could march a long way, it's inspiring. For the Army, this kind of kit could mean quicker supply lines or fewer injuries during heavy lifting, and they're investing heavily in it. It's cost the US military tens of millions of dollars in development to get to this stage. The idea is, though, it could save time, money, and potentially lives. Uh, well, the military could use it for uh, carrying payloads, uh, carrying increased armor, uh, could be used on the battlefield to remove injured soldiers. There are still several stumbling blocks, but the US military could deploy robot suits based on this prototype within eight years. They won't fly or fire missiles, but designers are already imagining future versions more reminiscent of Hollywood. Rajesh Merchandani, BBC News in Salt Lake City, Utah.